Hello family, we appreciate you for coming back to our channel. Kindly stay with us till the end of this video. Enjoy! We start by sweeping the compound and get our items ready for cooking. Our boy carries the fish on his neck and takes the lead. We wash our plantain leaves and introduce our ingredients. We have tilapia, mackerel, crab, beef, wele, onion, pepper, momone, garlic and ginger, okra, cassava flour, and ademe. These are all the ingredients needed for today's recipe. Oilless okra soup with kokonte special. I bet you don't have to miss this one. If you are new here, kindly subscribe, like, share, and leave your comments. Wash and slice the okra into smaller pieces. Put charcoal into the coal pot, fetch water into the pot, and begin to grind the pepper, sliced onions, garlic and ginger. Add the natural spices and continue grinding. Put the pot containing the sliced okra onto the fire, set the locally made stove and start to slice the ademe. Add the ademe to the sliced okra on fire, add pepper and slice onions onto it. Set a pot on the wooden stove, put the beef, wele and crab into it and cover to boil. Add salt to the okra on fire. Add salt to the grinded ginger and garlic and continue to grind. Slice the tilapia into pieces. Add water and wash it thoroughly. Put the sliced tilapia into the earthenware bowl containing the grinded ginger and garlic to spice it.
check the steaming meat on fire. We now stir the boiling okra. Add some of the grinded ingredients onto the beef. We lay and crab on fire and stir together. Slice onions onto it. pepper and salt to taste. Wash and break the mackerel into pieces and add to the boiling beef, crab and willy on fire. We then add the tilapia, stir and cover to boil. Take off the pot containing the okra from the fire, add more charcoal, Put a pot onto it, pour water into the pot and cover to boil. Open the boiling meat and fish, stir and cover to continue boiling. Put the okra onto the boiling meat and fish, stir and leave it to boil. We then add pepper and leave it to continue boiling.
their soup is now ready. We then take it off the fire. We check and reduce the level of the boiling water. Carefully pour in the kukunti flour into the hot water and begin to stir. Now the driving begins. Mix some of the kukunte flour with water, add to the driving kukunte and continue to drive. Stay until it's softened. Our kukunte is now ready. We serve it into the earthenware bowl. Scoop out some of the soup from the pot. Pour it on the kukunte and voila! Our food is now ready for consumption. This is one of the best African nutritious food you can find in Ghana. This is so delicious! Thank you so much for staying with us till the end. Kindly subscribe, like, share and leave your comments for more. See you in our next video. Until then, it's bye for now. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe. See you in our next video. Bye bye.